Eric Keller here with Enthusiast Auto Group. We're extremely proud to present to you the collection of BMW legends. This group of 13 critically curated cars represents some of the absolute best driving BMWs and most beautifully designed examples the brand has built over the last three and a half decades. These cars represent what the brand is all about at the heyday of their career and are responsible for so many enthusiasts' deep passion and love for the brand. We're open to any and all really high quality trade-ins and would certainly modify and adjust this group of cars to meet the next collector's wishes and current existing collection. Each car has been selected for its special attributes, high quality and pedigree. Each has gone through our very comprehensive rejuvenation program, ensuring turnkey readiness and reliability. This is a 2003 Z8, six speed S62 powered car. One of the few 2003s that were not an Alpina. This two owner fully documented all original, fully complete car down to its VIN matched coffee table book. Has the performance package. It was installed at a very early age, thus the laser straight body lines, clear headlamps, smooth dash, all the normal Z8 shortcomings are non-existent in this car and that is why it bears the EAG name. E30 M3 Sport Evolution. This 2.5 liter S14 powered example is the final E30 homologated for racing, of which it won more races than just about any car ever built. This car was the first purpose-built race car by the brand, and this all original, unmodified, preserved example from Germany has had just two owners, and we're excited to bring it to market for the first time in North America. Estoril Blue on Solid Black S54 M Coupe, the clown shoe, the ultimate driving coupe. <laughs> these things are just a hoot. You cannot drive these cars slow. You will get tickets driving these cars. Ask me how I know. This is a repeat car, complete as all of our cars are. Window sticker, service records. Because we start with the absolute best examples, we certainly aim to own all of our cars again when our clients are done enjoying them. That's the case with this Lime Rock, several years ago sold to a client out west. It has now just 4,000 miles. 200 Lime Rocks built, last of the S65, powered V8, naturally aspirated M3s, last M3 with two doors. Uh, this is a modern classic and the one to have amongst E92s, fire orange, same as the M3 GTS. These are great cars. The E36 M3 lightweight, internally dubbed the CSL by BMW during production. This 12,000 mile all original, never modified, M3 Lightweight is coming to market with EAG for the second time. They made 126 Lightweights. We're very fortunate to have bought and sold about 30 of them. Some of the most significant ones that have come to market have come through our hands and we know them extremely well. This is among the best that we've had and that's why it's part of this collection of BMW Legends. E28 M5. The Wolf in Sheep's Clothing, the original Q ship, this car is responsible for so many people's love and adornment of the brand and the motivating factor of why I started Enthusiast Auto Group 18 years ago. This car represents what the brand is best known for. It's an absolute joy to drive. And that's why so many of them have huge mileage and have suffered uh, lots of attrition. Finding an all original, numbers matching, original paint example, that's tough. And that's what this car represents. The E39 M5, the beast, the Swiss army knife of BMW driving experiences. It does everything very well. This is the second time we brought this Le Mans Blue over Silverstone to market. It's one of just 21 built in this color combo. We have about 15 grand of improvements that we've invested rejuvenating this M5 to needs nothing turnkey condition. We don't need to spend that much 
we know and choose to spend that much so that the next owner has a great experience, very low responsibility, and the time spent with the car is where they belong, in the driver's seat, not in the chair at the lobby of the service center. 1M Coupe, 740 built for the United States. This 3,000 mile example is all original, never modified, fully protected in clear bra film. This is one of the best ones that we've brought to market and again, why it's part of this collection. The Z1, the only BMW built with sliding doors. This E30 based M20 powered 2.5 liter it's really, really, really a fun car to drive. We've had one in our collection since 2011, and it's the first car I think about driving when spring comes around. The amount of heads that turn at every event you go to when you let somebody push that button never ceases to amaze me. Uh, this 10,000 mile car is fully documented. It just arrived, and we're excited to bring it to market for the first time. We have the Shark, the E24 M6, this 26,000 mile 1988 final year car. It's one of 21 built in lac silver, second time we've brought this car to market. And it's one of the best all original examples out there. It's low enough mileage to be in the collection. It's high enough mileage to be driven, enjoyed, and uh, played with. It's a great driving car, looks beautiful. The replacement for the E9 chassis, as many know. Definitely a stunning example in lac silver. Speaking of color combos, Interlagos Blue on cinnamon. The C46 M3 is a competition package, the ZCP. It's the second time we've brought this car to market, as is this red M Coupe. Also S54 powered. The last BMW M car with a metal key that you stick in an ignition and twist. It has a dipstick. That's novel uh, here in upcoming years. Many people will never even know what a dipstick is in coming generations. This is a great dual purpose car. You can drive it on the street, drive it on the track. It does everything very well. And finally, the centerpiece of the collection of BMW Legends is a car I'm very, very proud of. It took a long time to find an M1 worth EAG investment. We've looked at about 30 different streetcars to finally land upon this one that had a very notable uh, original owner, a uh, big car collector in the fashion industry. The primary owner of this M1 is was Gordon Medenica. Gordon is the first BMW president of the CCA, Car Club of America. He's the founder of the M1 registry and responsible for so much information sent to fellow M1 owners in period. This was his second and final M1, owned it for about a decade. It is among the absolute best road cars left in existence. It's fully documented. Original owner's manual, certificate of uh, authenticity. The um, uh, car is really in remarkable shape. It has about 30,000 kilometers. I've driven this car about 500 of those, and they're about 500 of the most enjoyable kilometers I've ever put on a car. Supercar styling with absolute killer, killer reliability. That S38 just sings, and you can just hear it gulping for air right behind your head. It's a really awesome experience. Not enough enthusiasts have had the pleasure of enjoying. I certainly encourage any and all questions. I again welcome any and all high quality trade-ins and would be happy to adjust this grouping with other vehicles in our inventory to tailor to the next collector's needs. Certainly follow us on Facebook, Instagram, subscribe to our YouTube channel. We've got a lot more content like this. Really excited to bring these group of cars together and offer them to the market for the first time. If you have a collection that you're interested in uh, finding a great home for, you know who to call. We'll be here in open arms for quality every day. Thanks for tuning in.